and welcome back to New Jersey Homestead. Uh, it's fall here at the homestead here in New Jersey, uh, about 60 degrees and the leaves are changing and it is definitely getting cooler. And with that, a lot of the critters are coming into the shop. Um, they pretty much devoured a roll of paper towels. I'm thinking that they were using it for bedding or something, but there's uh, mouse poop all over the place. I usually use the standard um, mouse traps, the typical classic ones you'd see in a, you know, a Bugs Bunny movie or something. And something like this, and they're pretty straightforward. Uh, the negative is the mice are very clever and, and they can delicately eat the peanut butter off of the trap trigger without triggering it. So I'll have the trap sitting there all ready to be sprung and the bait's gone. And I'll see that multiple times. So the old fashioned mouse traps, I just don't think are that great anymore. Um, so what I purchased to give a try to is what's called the Rat Zapper. We're going to give this a try and see how it works. It's supposed to, according to them, you mainly clean, effective, fast, eliminate your rat or mouse problem. Now let's see how it works. Looks like it's fairly straightforward. Boom. Has a large opening, I guess the mouse is supposed to go into. The metal. So there's this metal backing here. They tell you not to put it on there. And inside, there's the floor, and they're telling you to put it on the floor in the back. I'm assuming inside of, you kind of can see this metal, where there's the metal wall for sure, then there's this metal plate. I'm, I'm assuming that's gonna be like the, uh, electric chair for the mice. So I'll get a good size dollop of peanut butter here. My plan is to put it all the way in there. I got a good size dollop of peanut butter in there. I had a little bit extra, so I put it in the middle of where that metal plate is. So I don't know if that's gonna make much of a difference. And this, four D-volt batteries, which I Generally with traps, you want to put them in a corner, someplace dark where rats like to go. I have this one over here. Uh, that has caught me a few. Um, back here, I think is the best spot, kind of in the dark. So I've put it down right there. Well, as far as ease of setup, I give it an A+. Take it out of the box, stick it in there, put the batteries in, turn it on, and you're good to go. Um, Generally, the mice tend to be nocturnal, so we'll see tomorrow morning how the trap did. All right, so I came in to check, and I see that the box has a little red light on it. I'll turn it off. And there is a dead mouse in here. So overall, now it's been a week I've been using this Rat Zapper by Victor. Um, it does very well. I've been very happy with this. Killed three mice. The nicest thing is how clean and easy it is. You just pick it up, turn off the machine, dump it out. And no, you don't have to touch anything. There's no gore. I know some of the simpler mouse traps, there would be some blood or, you know, they, it killed the mice immediately, but it was almost like a guillotine. Uh, this, there's no mess at all. So it's very nice as far as that goes. And like I said, easy to dump out. Uh, now, if you have a cat or something or a small dog that could get a paw in there, probably not a good idea. If there were children around, you wouldn't want that. If they put their hand in there, I'm assuming they would get some kind of an electric shock. Uh, but overall, I give this uh, an A-plus grade. I really like it. Uh, pretty easy to work. So, until next time, here on New Jersey Homestead, have a good day.